Okay, welcome back to Chrono Trigger, everybody. Hope everybody had a fine weekend. Um, we're going to continue our epic adventure to save the world. Uh, we got Ms. Octo hanging out in the chat. I am uh, dressed as uh, Chrono himself. And we're going to do some more of these quests. And probably not going to be a long stream because I do have work tomorrow, but... Um, one more week until Thanksgiving break, and I get a whole week off. And really, it's nine days. It's more than more than just a week, so pretty cool. So we'll probably get some extra streams. Probably a lot of either Fire Emblem and Mario RPG coming up. Okay, so let's let's listen to the clues one more time um, and see which what what else we need to do. Uh, as always, amazing hair. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so. There's the Black Omen. Right, we still haven't done that yet. And then... Okay, so there is something in the in the prehistoric timeline that we need to check out. Probably related to Isla. And that's it, I think. Okay. However, she does not give us a clue the way the other characters did. But let's take her with us, I guess, and then we will, um, let's get that out of there. How was your Sunday? It was pretty good. I just, um, I went out and just, I'm gonna turn the sound down a little bit. I think the game might be kind of, no, I think it's okay. Um, I, I just did a couple things, you know, nothing exciting. Um, just took it easy to mentally prepare for going back to work tomorrow. All right, let's drop Marl, and we'll get Isla in here. Maybe do this this crew for a little bit. All right, uh, I guess let's head to her time period, and then the Black Omen after that. I, I guess. I mean, I think are we getting close to the end? I think we must be. Let's take off. All right, take me to prehistory. I don't think we should let the cave woman drive, but oh well. That's the decision that we've made. Okay. We're looking for a stone. That's all we know, I guess. Um, uh oh. Controller's freaking out. B, when was the last time you got a haircut? <laughs> Uh, fairly recently, actually. Um, hmm. Hi, Mia. My cat's hanging out with me. I, where do we even start? She said her village, right? She said something about her village, so maybe we'll start there. That's this place, right? Maybe he can help us. Isla! Isla, okay? Kino, okay? Lavos fall, reptites gone, that good, but get cold now. Hunt, but not many beasts. But Kino no stop. Isla no worry, leave to Kino. Okay, that didn't actually help me much. I can't go up there. Hmm. Okay, well let's just keep talking to the different villagers maybe. We'll get a we'll get a clue. Maybe this guy knows. Make strong armor. Use many rubies. Trade for petal, fang, horn, feather. Ten each. You want trade? I don't think his armor's real. You have no thing. No thing, no trade. I don't think his armor's really going to be that great at this point in the game. Go hunt. Hunting range. Get petal, fang, horn, feather. When rain, rare monster come out. Rare one, good hunt. When it's raining? I didn't even know this game had weather. Trade your shiny stone. Uh, I think we're good on these, dude. Oh wait, we we can definitely use some more. Well, we, mid potions aren't really that great, but we'll buy we'll buy some because I mean we got tons of money. Panaceas are probably helpful too, though. All right, we'll get eighty of those. We still don't know what this ambrosia does. 
I've got a lot of stuff to sell, but I mean, I've got $400,000. I don't really, I'm not too worried about it. Um, lightning stun dinosaur, you know. I did know that, actually. Uh, okay, meeting grounds. Maybe this guy knows. Ioka people, good, nice people. When village burned, they say, okay, live here. <laughs> I look inside trade hut, new thing there. Trade hut? Isn't that where I just was? Bear cold! Sky, many cloud, no can see sun. White, cold stuff fall from sky, what that? Oh, you're talking about snow? I don't know, but my first playthrough of this game, I didn't get the mage guy with the cloak in my party. Uh, I think he's optional, yeah, because you can kill him instead. You can fight him. Well, I don't know if you... I, I didn't do that, so I don't know if you actually kill him, but you can fight him instead. Who's the hot blonde running around on all fours? That's Isla, dude. She's a cave woman. She's amazing. She likes to kiss her party members a lot. But yeah, there was a point when you could fight him or have him join us, and I just had him do that. I don't think we want to go this way. Um, how? Do, I, just, I just wish I had a clue of where I'm supposed to be going. Let's see. Have we been to these huts? That's another hut, another hut. Well, let's check it out. Hi. Find strange rock, but feel icky when touched, so throw away. Well, that sounds important. Happy water all gone before never happen. What? Less monster now cold, less game too. Is she aware that she's in a video game? Whoa. Better cold. Isla quit chief, now Kino chief. Big fire, Lavos fall, now get cold. <laughs> he threw away your stone. But where did he throw it? Well, I mean, I guess that's a clue, but, like, where the hell did he... I mean... I can ride on my on a pterodactyl as well if I wanted to. I mean, where would you... If this was Minecraft, you would throw it in the lava. So maybe... <laughs> maybe that's it? Yeah, we don't want that. All right, well, this is going to be the first part of the stream, just figuring out where we're supposed to go. <clears throat> I mean, the other ones, they, like, gave you clues. The sunshine, maybe? No. Hmm. Bro, this controller is fucking up. I have to keep unplugging it. It's, it's got, like, stick drift or something. What's this place? The dactyl nest? You know, no, I don't think we want to go there. What about that place? Loruba Ruins? New? What? What the matter? I was sound asleep, new. Can a new not get some rest? I changed Isla's name, so please let me go back to my dreams, new. But no, I don't want to change her name. <laughs> Nighty night. Okay, well. Oh, I forgot. I don't need this stone, so I give it to you. But I don't think this is it. Silver gemstone? I don't think that's it. Maybe it is. It's not under um, key items, though, so I don't think it is. I think it's an accessory. Yeah, it's that's not it. Enable spin strike triple tech? That sounds dope. I don't know if, who, should, who I should give that to, though. I mean, spin strike? That sounds like a, a chrono move, right? Um, so what the fuck? I... I 
mean, it's not going to be in here, is it? I don't want to fight all these monsters. I don't think it's... Uh, I'm going to keep searching, but if I don't find some kind of clue soon, I might uh, I might have to look it up. Mystic Mountains? This is just the beginning area. No, we don't need that. I mean, Kino is not going to help us, seriously? Like, isn't he supposed to be, like, the chieftain? Maybe now that I've talked to the guy, I'll have a new option here. Nope. Oh, my God. So, he threw it away? So, what? Is there, like, a trash can or something? <laughs> um... Hey, what do you guys do with your trash? Did you throw it in here? I guess we should go to that guy's house. Oh, not not this guy. I think it's this one. Find strange rock, but feel icky when touched, so throw away. Okay, is this... Is this your trash can? <laughs> I don't think I'm on the right track. Talk to him again? Yeah, he says the same thing. Um, God. It's going to be something dumb. I know it. As soon as I look it up, it's going to be something really stupid. Uh, that's what always happens. I mean, I mean, maybe there's more clues. I mean, they keep saying it's cold. I don't know how that really relates. Um, hmm. Hmm, indeed. Yeah, let's get in the ship. <clears throat> he threw it away. It's like, I mean, it could be anywhere. I mean... This just takes us to the reptite thing. We don't want to care about that right now. And we tried here. It's not here. Even though I don't think we've used this place yet. <clears throat> um, sure, if you have a clue, I mean, we might as well get this adventure started. <laughs> Did you get the moonstone yet? Uh... Probably not. <laughs> Let's see. Moonstone. Uh, I don't. I'm guessing that's a key item, so I'm guessing no. Or unless it's one of these, but I don't think it is. Yeah. Well, wait. But moonstone sounds familiar. Didn't we get that? You're doing the faded hour. Yes. That's well. It's like the. Yeah. Like I mean, I don't know if it's a side quest or if I have to do it, but yeah, it's like. That's the chapter we're on, yeah. Yeah, chapter, yeah. Hmm. Moonstone does sound familiar, though. But yeah, that, that's the quest, yeah. Or the, the chapter we're on is the faded hour, yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna I'm gonna look it up. Um Oh. Okay, so I think I have to tra trade with that guy. That's what I think that's what it is. Um, and, 
I don't have enough of the things um, in order to do that. I have, a, I have 12 petals and 11 feathers, but what else did he want? Fangs, horns, and feathers. Petals, fangs, horns, and feathers. Oh my god. So I have to go grind? Seriously? That's what I have to do? I have nine horn. Oh, so I just need one more horn. It says you get the moonstone in the future first. Uh... I feel like we have that. But I'm not seeing it on the list. You'll just... Yeah, you can't post a link. Um... Um... Well, let's get another... Let's just see what this guy gives me. Um... So let's go fight some monsters. They also mentioned something about a special monster if it's raining, but I don't know how to make it rain, so... I think I only need one more fang. Do these guys have fangs? They don't look like they have fangs. It would help if I knew the last thing you did. Well, the thing is that I don't think we have to do these in order, because... In the story, um... Well, we've mostly been doing side quests lately, it seems like. Like, we did Robo's thing. We've done all the characters' little quests. Um, here, I'll just... I'll just pull it up. Because I gotta beat this game. <laughs> so... Oh, we're really close to the end. Wow. Um... Okay, we did Chrono's side quest. These are all optional, by the way. We don't even have to do this, but I would like to do it. Um, hello. So you're doing the quest uh, for the prehistoric stone, yes. Um... Okay, I got the I got that from the the new. The armor Isla was bragging about was the ruby armor, which cuts fire hits by eighty percent and offers better defense than any armor you'll have in, uh, so far. Blah blah blah. You need to get ten of each trading item. Yeah, I th I think we just have to trade with the guy. I think that's all it is. Um, if you hang around the hunting range, which is really close to the dactyl's nest to the to the east and slightly south of it, long enough and fight a few news when it rains. Okay. There there was like a weather mechanic in this game. How you doing, alleyway? So go here? Is that what it said? The hunting range. I think that's up here. No? Where's the hunting range? They said it's near the dactyl nest. Oh, here, okay. The laundry's done, and I just made a mug of ruibos. Is that, like, tea? I don't even know what that is. Okay, apparently it's gonna rain at some point? <laughs> I didn't know that, like, that, that happens in this game. <laughs> B, it's red tea? Interesting. Oh! Roibos. Oh, okay. Well, it's raining, so I guess we can find news in you. Oh, it stopped. <laughs> Man, that's like, that's some freaking Florida weather right there. B, what is your go to baking recipe? <laughs> I'm not really much of a baker. I don't think I've ever. Actually, one time I did bake cookies. I 
think we have enough now. I don't think we need to fight the news. All right, there we go. So in theory, we could get ruby armor for everybody. But I'm not going to do that because it sounds really boring. So we're going to give her the ruby armor. Oh, it's not even as good as what she's already got, but it does reduce fire damage to one-fifth, which is a lot. And I'm guessing we're probably going to be fighting some fire monsters at some point. So we'll go ahead and give it to her. I mean, Lavos probably shoots fire, right? Okay, well, that's that. Um, okay, so then there's Luca's. We did the Lucas though, didn't we? There's a very special stone that can shine its light on each generation from the distant past to the far future. Did we do this one? God, I have such a bad memory, dude. Um... No, this is where you get the Moonstone. This is what you were talking about. Yeah, I don't think we did this one. We did do Frog side quest. I don't think we've done Magus's one either. Have we? Oh, no, we did. I think we inadvertently did it. I don't think I realized it was a quest, but yeah, I'm pretty sure we did this. Uh, who the fuck is Fiona? Oh, we did this. We did this. Okay. Um, and we did Robo. And we did Marl. Then we just have to do the Black Omen after this, I guess. Okay. All right. So, um, I guess we should do Luca's thing. I, I don't think we did this one. I don't remember fighting that monster. I'm looking at the picture of it. I don't remember fighting that thing. Um, go to 2300 AD and the Sun Palace. Okay. Sun Palace. That's Protodome. It's not that place. Sun Palace? Abandoned Sewers, not that place. Aristome. Banger Dome. These don't look like palaces. Yeah, I, I don't think this is it. The palace is inside someone's heart. It said 2300 AD, right? That's this. That's where we are. Is it this place? That's Geno Dome. Oh, we're gonna get to see Geno soon because that game comes out on Friday. Um, I'm... Is it... Maybe it's one of these. No. Keeper's Dome? I'm just, like, so bad at remembering where everything is. Um, yeah, 2300 AD. Bottom left of the map, it says? Okay, that helps. Should have read that. Um, where's the map? Oh, down there. Oh, wow, I didn't even know this place existed. Okay, so I don't think we've done this one. All right, let's do this one. Oh, wait, no, we've done this. Haven't we? Uh, apparently not. Okay. Okay, we're just jumping right in. I did not... Okay, uh, Jesus. Ice spell, maybe? Water would probably be good, right? She's going to take, like, no damage from this thing because it's made of fire. Oh, man, she's perfect for this fight right now. Oh, I should have made three of them. 
Uh, that would have just been a bunch of grinding. But yes, attack her. Keep attacking her. Yeah, that's she's the one you should be sending your fire to. Oh, wait, they're counterattacking. Hopefully they don't counterattack with... Hopefully that's because I used a physical... Oh, fuck. Seriously? Oh, God. Yeah, this is bad. Oh, my God. They're all gonna... So it, it counterattacks whenever... Oh, and water heals it? That makes no sense. Pokemon told me that water is effective against fire. Dude, they're getting so owned right now. Well, he's dead. Alright, maybe we'll stop using mass attacks and, and do, like, one thing at a time, maybe. Bro... Wow, this would be so easy if everybody had that armor. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to go back and get it. I mean, we don't. We only have to do it three times, right? I mean, ooh, black plate. Maybe we should just go back and get two more armors, and then this fight will be a breeze. And we could use a different lineup too. I wish there was a way for me to forfeit. Oh, she's dead. <laughs> okay, well, I was not expecting that to be a boss fight, like, right as you walk in the door. Uh, okay, let's uh, let's resume. And let's leave. <laughs> and then we're going to go back in time. We're going to get two more of those armors. It said killing the news... It should give you a lot of stuff. The thing is, I have to get 20 of each one, because I barely had enough to buy the first one. But hopefully we'll run into some of those news uh, when it starts raining. These guys drop stuff too, though, don't they? Easy peasy. Frog is so cute. I don't like his little flexing pose. It just looks a little silly, but other than that, he looks awesome. Hey, we just got two of each. That's not bad. What the fuck was that sound? All right, I guess we'll just keep running around until we find... What's this thing? At least they're super easy to kill. <laughs> two feathers, two petals. Okay, this won't take that long. It keeps making noise every time I kill something. Oh, boy. Oh, it's raining. So where are the news? The NU. Where are the new? I need to find a new... They said there would be new. Oh, I like how it just turns off like a sprinkler. It's like, shh. That's how it is in Florida, though. It'll start raining, and then it'll just, like, it'll just cut off like somebody turned the, the, the spigot. True. the froggy the prehistoric frog he's basically killing like his like unevolved version of himself well i guess he's not literally a frog right he's like a human but he was turned into a frog
Oh my god, this controller. I swear to god. Alright, it's raining again. So where are the new? Let's try this way. Oh, there's one. How do I get up there? How do? How do? How do? Alright, we gotta figure out how to get up there. Oh, here we go. Okay. And then I guess we have to wait for it to rain again? <laughs> this is where he was, right? Like right here? Is he just gonna like blip into existence once it starts raining? Or do I have to like go off screen and get him to come back? With their line dancing. Dang it, he's not there. Alright, maybe he spawned. Because I, I moved further away. No, he's not there! Ugh. This is so silly. Let's wait here for it to start raining. And then maybe I'll spawn over there. Dude, look at Isla just like staring down Frog, and then Magus is like facing the other way. This is riveting gameplay, by the way. Start raining! Start raining! All right, I must fight you. Will you beat the sequel to Chrono Trigger? Probably not right away, but yeah, I wouldn't mind playing it at some point. Chrono Cross? I don't know, some people were saying it's not that great. You strong, here take. Obtain three petals, three, okay, I see. So th this is definitely the way to do it. That is so loud, why does it do that? Third eye? What the fuck is a third eye? Oh my god, like, you just need to open up your third eye, you know? And then you'll be able to understand. Doubles evasion? Hmm, that's pretty cool. Should I give that to somebody? What is she using right now? She's just using this, which boosts the success rate of charm. I don't know, I kind of feel like that's not that great. I mean, let's give her the third eye. I wonder what max evasion is, though. Is it... I, like, what if I gave it to somebody with less... Like, if I gave it to him... Okay. Okay, I think it's a hundred. Okay, why don't we just give it to her? Maybe she'll never get hit with anything. That'd be cool. All right, well, we got to keep farming because we need 20 of each of those things. So it's now a grinding farming stream. And we wait for the rain. So how's everybody doing? Go, go, go. Hopefully I can fight him more than once. I wonder if... I might not be able to. Hmm, I didn't think about that. Alright, well... I guess we'll just keep running around and just fight whatever monsters there are until we... Until we have enough. How many more do I need? Not that many. Okay, we're, we're getting there. I don't think there's any more monsters, though. I think we killed them all. I guess we could leave and come back. I'm not sure it has to be monsters here, though. Like, couldn't it just be any monsters? Like, don't these... Doesn't everything drop stuff in this? 
part of the world. Ooh, I should go fight those things. Oh, are these not the the rubbles? I thought they were rubbles. No, they're called schists. Okay, all I got was a pedal from that, so I think the hunting grounds actually are better. Alright, back to the hunting grounds, I guess. It'll be worth it once we have that flame armor on all three of them. I feel like we're getting close to the end, but now I'm just like... But part of me's like... We haven't unlocked, like, all the stuff. Like, all the different abilities. Like, hardly any of them have triple tags. I mean... I definitely grinded. Well, maybe there's more. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm not as close as I think. Let's go see if the new is back. If I can fight him again. Yep, he is. Nice. Alright, three of each. Nice. So how many more do I need? Okay, we're good on feathers, we need some more petals, we need some more fangs, and we need some more horns. Okay. Well, obviously the easiest way to do this is to just keep fighting that guy, so we will leave and come back. <laughs> that seems to be the best way to do it. Two of each. <sighs> I guess this is grinding up their TP as well, so that's, you know, can't complain about that. Alright, and then we wait for the rain. Will this be enough once we get this? I wonder if this will be enough. So, we need three more petals, which we'll get. Okay, oh, the horns, though. We would need two more horns after this. Damn. All right, well. Start raining. Actually, maybe I'll fight these guys, because they might give us horns. They, those are horns, right? They have horns. Are they called iron clods? Hey, horns. I need horns. Of course. Feathers and petals. I mean, that's what they looked like they had. Those guys definitely were feathers and, and petals, not horns. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I'm not wearing my uh, little scarf, I forgot. Uh, they're almost dead. Kiss, 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 kiss. There we go. Okay, so I think all we need left is, um, I need two more horns. Okay, so we'll just leave and come back. I think those frogs drop horns. sense for a, a frog to drop petals and, and, and feathers because they eat birds but the horned creature doesn't drop horns please give me horns please tell me you're giving me horns there we go okay good so we should be good now i feel like an mmo player <laughs> grinding for materials another ruby armor and another ruby armor. Nice. Okay, so now we have one enough for the whole party. So, do I want to use this party, though, is the question. Because I could... It is Luca's quest, right? So we might as well get her in there. We'll do this group. This actually is better than what she's wearing. And him, too. Okay. All right, nice. Okay, so it actually is an improvement for them. All right. All right. Now we shall go back to the future. Probably save. <laughs> As we know, some crazy shit's going down in there. Lots of flaming monsters. Um, water was healing it for some reason, so I'm going to go in with the strategy that maybe I should attack individual enemies first. Or maybe just focus on the eyeball and ignore the fire. Let's try that first. Okay, it's still counterattack, but it shouldn't do it five times, right? Okay. And he missed again. Alright, let's try it one more time. If we miss a third time, then it's... Okay, so you can't hit it. Alright, let's just try attacking... Look how little damage we're taking, dude. We're taking, like, no damage at all. I wonder if I can make him go to sleep. What, what was that? Ow! Holy crap. Um, does she have a sleep thing? There it is, Hypno Wave. Let's try that. She's gonna need a heal. God, it's counterattacking a lot. Should help. All right, let's all let's attack one of the. This this does do damage, unfortunately. Ow. Let's try attacking the flames. Okay, 
Holy crap, that does like no damage. Jesus, okay. Um Bells were healing it though. I don't know what to do. Oh, got a crit that time for 24. Jesus. Um. Oh. Okay. I like. That. That's a very clear message that it's sending with that sound effect. That was correct. Good job. Okay, so I guess we'll attack that one. Maybe there's like an order to it or something. <laughs> it's like a game show! Doo -doo -doo -doo. <laughs> Alright, all in on that front right one, I guess. <laughs> what a rewarding sound. I tried boulder toss on it. She just picked up a ball of fire and threw it. Oh, that one didn't actually do any damage. Okay, hold on. So I guess it has to be regular attacks. Oh wait, it's not doing the sound anymore. Okay, maybe it's a different one now. Sucks. Oh, she actually didn't take too much damage. Let's try the one on the. Stop spinning. Let's try that one. Okay, it wasn't that one. Let's try the top one, and then we'll try that one. It wasn't that one. Okay, we'll try the left one. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yes. Okay. Kind of a silly fight. Oof. So it seems like it's damaging the the eye. She's gonna kiss herself. Oh, I bet you... Okay, when it does that, the idea is that they don't go back to the same place. I get it, okay. I bet it's the front left one. Try the far right one. No. Nope. Maybe the back one. No. I I guess it's the front right. I see we're wearing our favorite costume. <laughs> yes. A character that's not even in the party at the moment. What? Which one have we not done? We've done them all, haven't we? Maybe it spun again and I didn't realize.
Maybe we're supposed to start attacking the eye? Because, yeah, none of these are doing the sound anymore. Let's try the eyeball, I guess. Uh, oh, that doesn't work either. What the f- Alright, we're just gonna keep attacking him. I don't know which one it is. Did we... We tried all of them. What? Uh, oh. <laughs> what the fuck was that boss fight? That was such a weird boss. Okay, we did it. Kiss, 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 kiss. Oh. It's not over yet, is it? Shit. This is the ancient sunstone? It looks like it's been drained of all its energy. We could probably recharge it with sunlight, but that would take eons. I know what to do. I know what to do. This time I got it. And it's not because I looked at the walkthrough, okay? <laughs> it's not because I looked at the walkthrough. We're just finally going to use that sun shrine. Because I've been obsessed with that sun shrine the whole time. And I think what we want to do is go... She said it would take eons, so we'll go back in time, put it in the, the sun shrine, and then go back to the future, I guess. Right? Was there even a sun shrine in prehistory? I think there was, right? Um, where was the sun shrine? I think it's that top right one. I think it's this place. So I think if we put it right here. Oh, warm, good sun. Place the moonstone? Yes. No charge yet, or change yet. Okay, and then now we need to go, I guess, to wherever else there's a... I wonder if we just go to, like... Because I don't think there is a sun shrine in the future or a cataclysm. Maybe the present. Because we want to let as much time as possible pass. Is this it? I think this is the, shine, the sun shrine. Yeah, okay. So that probably did it. Uh-oh. Someone take, we find! Uh... Shit, that sucks. Someone took it. Um... Now, is it that, could we go back to, like, the Middle Ages and get there before them? Is that, maybe that's it? Or is it going to be hunting down the person? Like, maybe if we go here, it's still there, but it's long enough that it charged? I don't know. Yeah, there it is. Is it charged, though? It won't let me interact with it. So, we probably have to figure out who took it. Damn. I was kind of hoping you could, like, beat him there, you know? Okay, we'll figure out who stole it. The festival was here, wasn't it? But it's not there anymore. I was thinking maybe they would take it to the festival, but... Uh... Maybe Melchior has it? I don't know. Nope, he's not here. Let's try the market, maybe? It would be kind of funny if it just ended up in a shop somewhere, you know? There's got to be a game that's done that before. Well, 
we pass the one hour mark of our stream tonight. We're looking for the stone. The moonstone to turn it into a sunstone or something. I'm not sure what it's going to actually do, but uh, do, you, do you know where it is? That's the ghost thing. We don't. I don't think it's that. We could try this village, maybe. <clears throat> God, do I just have to talk to every single person until somebody mentions it? Okay, here we go. Do you know of the legendary sunstone? I discovered an ancient scroll that spoke of a fearsome weapon that could be made by combining a shard of the stone with one of the rainbow shell that the original Toma once sought. Okay, but, but that, I guess you don't have it? looking for anything with suns down. Hmm. Sunstone? How the black omen shines in the shines in the sun. Tomorrow should be a beautiful day as well. Alright. Nobody here knows anything about the sunstone. Careful with those tools. I mean, this guy was the only one that mentioned it. I discovered an ancient scroll that spoke of a fearsome weapon. I think that's just a clue about what to do with the sunstone, but not to find it. We're sure there's nothing I can do here. <laughs> no. I mean, it really would... Like, am I crazy? It's, it didn't let me interact with it in the Middle Ages. Like, it's still there. It's also sparkling, but I don't know if that just means it's charging. But yeah, I can't... I mean, I'm trying to interact with it. It won't let me. So, I think we have to figure out who stole it. Okay. Let's solve that mystery, Scoob. You guys know anything about Sunstone? Maybe the, uh... Maybe the castle? Castle even still there? Oh wait, the fairground was here. Oh, okay. I got mixed up. Also, I'm not sure we ever even did this boat. Did we ever go here? A mysterious whirlpool sometimes appears near here. What do you suppose could cause such a thing? I don't know, spinning water?
was kind of hoping I'd get sucked up in the whirlpool, because I was hoping to find a, uh, another side quest or something. I want to ride the ferry. Alright, take me back. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll spawn this time. Well, no whirlpool. Wait, where's it going? Oh, I guess that's right. Let's get back on track. I'm gonna go with my first instinct, which was the fair. Any games that we already did. Thanks, you're welcome. <laughs> what are we saying thank you for? Oh boy. I don't think it has to do with this. I guess we'll just keep looking for people to talk. Let's try the castle. That, I think that's a smart idea. Because maybe, like, I don't know. <laughs> maybe it's in the in the dungeon with the other treasures or whatever. Because the, the, the one guy was interested in, um, you know, the, the rainbow shell, which is apparently related. So maybe, I don't know, who knows. I'm just literally wandering around because I mean I, I don't I don't have any clue where it is. I mean, we'll just keep talking to people, I guess. Do you know where it is? So, oh, whoops. Okay, I get it. I was supposed to go back to the future. I didn't even know there was a sun shrine here. I guess I guess it's the sun palace. Oh no, maybe it's that maybe it's that place up there. Okay, that makes sense. So I guess whoever took it puts it back? Is that the idea? Nope, it's still gone. Okay, so I must have misread that. Hold on. Okay. Apparently, I would. Yeah, this was pretty convoluted. I'm. I'm. I don't feel bad for not figuring this out. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go to the Middle Ages. But didn't I try that? Didn't I swear this is what I tr I tried this.
It says you find a power tab here. What? There is, it is glowing like there's an item, but I can't click on it. Oh my god, whatever. Oh, this game is very uh, obscure with some stuff. There was the whirlpool. My, my, you've certainly got enthusiasm. Why don't you take this to help you get your equipment in order? Oh, thank you. Um, I don't fucking know. <laughs> Even the walkthrough doesn't make sense. There's the whirlpool. Oh my god. Okay, so... Head back to the future, and the stone will be missing, and Magus will intuitively guess it's been missing for 1,300 years? So what, do we need Magus in the party? So he'll say that? Is that what it is? That can't be right. Let's put Luke in the front. Get mages in here. Try those. <laughs> I, I don't understand. Okay, let's assume he said that. And then it says, first head back to 600 AD, then go to 1000 in the present. Once you find that the moonstone's missing from the sun shrine, head over to Pore at the southwest corner of the map, and the mayor's house is glowing. What the fuck? We were just at the mayor's house. It's not glowing. City. Is that is that this one? Or maybe it's that one down south. I don't think we Okay. I would have probably made a connection there. <sighs> okay. I went to everywhere except for this city, yep. Everybody says daddy's greedy, that's not true, is it? Yeah, he is. He stole my stone. Moonstone? Never heard of it. Fucking asshole. I hate my dad more than anyone in the whole world. Jesus. You truly have a talent for dancing around objectives. <laughs> uh, but how was I supposed to know to come down? I mean... <laughs> I guess eventually I would have gone there and seen it glowing and been like, oh, well, there it is. But, like, other than just stumbling upon it, like, I guess I guess you're just supposed to search everywhere, and I just never did. Daddy loves me more than he loves money more than me. Jesus. Um, okay, well, where is it? Do you have it? All right, well, I guess it's probably glowing somewhere. Is it? We went up here.
I know you have it, dude. What the fuck? Where, where is it? Where are you stashing it? Does he have, like, a basement or something? Like... <laughs> I swear to God. Hey, if you want to get back at your dad, tell me where the stone is. Dude, what the fuck? Oh, I'm just, okay. <laughs> what the fuck? This is the craziest quest ever. I, I, there's no way I would have ever figured this out. Buy some jerky from the nearby snail shop. Okay. Don't we have snail jerky? Okay, got that. <laughs> and then... Speak to the woman across from the door? Wait, go to the elder's house, which will one day be the mayor's house. Oh, no, wait. Okay, I, I gotta read it. Okay, go back to 680. How would you ever figure this out? I mean, you just you would have to write down, like, every single thing every NPC says. <laughs> which I guess people did back then. I remember, like, Ocarina of Time came with a, um... You know, in the, in the instruction booklet, it had a page for notes. I guess it kind of makes sense, though, because this is the same city. So you gotta think, like, time. Is that spiced jerky you're carrying? Might you part with it for 10,000? Yes, here you go. Okay, so I gave her that, which I guess does what? When you were a kid with plenty of time and no internet, true. Oh, I was supposed to give it to her for free. Whoops. <laughs> oh, well. Um, in this new timeline, the mayor is much more generous. Oh, I get it. Jesus, that is... That is a convoluted quest. Holy crap. Okay, so I have to do it again. Because I fucked it up. Because the idea is you want to, um... You want to be nice to her so that she raises her kid to be generous, I guess, and then he grows up to... That's... Wow. So we have to teach her a lesson about kindness. Hopefully I didn't just fuck it up. Am I able to still... Am I able to do it again? Wait. Oh, I have to go back to the... So we got another one. I mean, it makes sense, but man, I would have never figured that out. I mean, wow. <laughs> I'm guessing that she talks about it or something. Like, you you just got to talk to all the NPCs and make the connections. But I never would have been able to figure that out. There's just no fucking way. Um, okay, so now this time we're going to let her have it for free. I'll teach my children from your example there are greater things in life than money. Which ties into what the kids were saying in the present. It all makes sense. I'm, it's just like, wow. It, it's kind of clever, too. I just... I would have never fucking figured that out. Okay. So hopefully that means he's now nice enough that he'll give it to me. 
You're interested in the Moonstone? A passing young traveler left it here. By all means, take it. It seems to be important to you folks. Yay. And then now the kids should be... They're happy. My dad is my favorite person in the whole world. I love my daddy. See, look, we, we helped this little family. All because of snail jerky. Okay, so now what? Do I take them to Melchior? Oh, do I have to go put it back? so it can continue charging. Okay. But now I'm tempted to try going back here because you're supposed to be able to get an item from there. Let's see if it lets me get it this time. No? I don't know what's going on with that, but all right, let's go to the future. Amazing. With energy like this, I should be able to make a really powerful weapon. Let's take it back to my house. Oh, just takes us straight there, huh? First, we'll extract the sunstone's energy and convert it to a more manageable form. Then, we'll just vacuum pack it into a cartridge. You did it, Luca. Nice. All right, she got Wonder Shot. Cool. Sometimes I amaze myself. Look at this. Hey, take a look at this, Luca. I borrowed a bit of the Sunstone to create something nifty of my own. Sunglasses. Cool. So, playtime determines damage? What? Alright, like, how long I've played the game? Damn, it's way stronger. I don't know, whatever. Um, and then, sunglasses, maybe? Do those, what do those do? Boosts damage. Gives cookies to all. Oh, thank you, Cassidy Rose Firefrost. <laughs> Chrono Trigger be life. It is a fun game. It's my very first time playing it. I'm not sure we really need that. I like the accessories we're using, honestly. Yeah, the music's great. You're right. Okay, well, I guess that was that. Um, I kind of want to check out this whirlpool now that it's there. Oh. Oh, I can just... I can just jump in. We haven't done this yet, have we? Maybe we have. This is actually looking kind of familiar. Yeah, we've done this, because the chests are open. Okay. Okay, well, I don't know what else there is to do other than the Black Omen, I guess, right? Because we've done all the, the side quests. So we're almost to the end. May I suggest something? Yes. Please. Go talk to Melchior. Oh, right, 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 right. At the, uh, because we can do something with the Rainbow Shell, that's right. But he's at the rainbow shell? Where the fuck was that? Also, where's my ship? Shit.
It's all the way over there? Well, wait, how am I gonna get over there without a ship? Um, because I don't think that ferry crosses over to the other island. Back in the cave? The one I just came out of? Okay, um, where's the, uh, rainbow shell? I thought I have the rainbow shell. What do you mean, at the rainbow shell? I have that. I have it in my inventory. Well, I have a rainbow shard. Oh, right, 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 right. In the, in the castle. Okay. Oh, we never opened this. A barrier ring. Cool. Don't... Hmm? There's something else in here. What in the world? Speed ring! Is that time-traveling dresser nearby? Oh, yes, it probably is. Yeah, that's probably it. Um... I... Th is it? I don't know. There, there has to be a way. We'll figure it out. Um, if I can get the fuck out of here... And there's my ship. Okay, so we're, we're good. We're good. Okay. Alright, so I think it was over here, right? Oh, no. The other door. The other door. You there. Ha, ah, a sunstone. That should do quite nicely. My work is complete. Prism spectacles. <laughs> Don't think that's the last of my bag of tricks. These arms have some use left in them. Hope he's making something else. My work is complete. Rainbow. I've created a rainbow. I finally feel like I'm doing something worthwhile. Oh, bye. Okay, what is a rainbow? I'm guessing the spectacles... Prism spectacles greatly boosts damage. Man, I, that sounds useful, but like... Should I give it to... I guess I should just give it to... That 80% attack rate, counterattack, is really helpful, though, but... If you give it to him... And then he won't counterattack. What do you think? I don't know, maybe that counterattack's not that great. Why don't we just do that? And then, but we can give Robo the better counterattack now. Rainbow's a sword. Okay, yeah, I was gonna look for it in just a sec. Um, his stamina goes up to max with that. Right, let's just get that. Okay, um, and then Chrono. 
gets a new Katanra called Rainbow, which is significantly stronger than what he has. And he gets 70% crit rate. Oh, wow. So he's getting 70% crit chance, and he's doing significant more damage with that thing he has equipped. So he's going to be pretty tough now. That's cool. All right, let's get out of here. I guess we might as well put him in the party. Alright, I guess we go to the Black Omen, right? I mean, I don't know... Uh, we've done all these other ones. We did Isla's, we did Luca's, we did Frog's, we did Mages, right? Because that's how we got the Gloom Club. Yeah, we got that. We did that Fiona thing with that crazy-ass skeleton monster. That thing was so annoying. Um, we, then we got that cutscene. We did Robo. We did Marl's, right? Yeah, we did Marl. Yeah, because that was the rainbow, the shell. Okay, so the Black Omen. I guess we're I guess we're going. Soon, B shall beat the game. I know, good, because we need to open up a slot for Mario RPG. <laughs> um, I want to put it in the title that we're going to the Black Omen. Okay, let's go. Chrono's like, I've got a rainbow sword. I'm so cool. I hang out with a frog and a vampire and a robot. <laughs> it's kind of like a story written by like a little kid, you know? Like, he's like running around with like a robot and then like a couple cute girls and like a frog. Like, and he's like time traveling. He's got a spaceship. He's got like spiky hair. It's like he like wrote his like a little boy story, you know? Um... Where am I going? Oh, um... I guess it doesn't matter, huh? Because the, the Black Omen's everywhere. It probably does matter, though, huh? Should I just do present day? That's where I am. There's gotta be some reason why you can, you can access it in every timeline, right? Let's just drop in. All right. Oh, that's right. She, like, whooped our ass the first time we were here. Fools, have you not learned your lesson? We are made immortal. We shall live forever with Lavos, who feasts upon this planet from within. You were going that way over this way here to, to go to that place over on this side over that way there to do the thing and find this other thing the first you got to do four lefts and a right before you do this other thing to go the other way <laughs> thank you very helpful um <laughs> all right ho hopefully we're stronger now so we should have no problem beating her Oh, wait, it's not her. She summons a monster. That's right. Oh, God. All right, here we go. Sacrifice yourself to Lavos and fulfill the only purpose left to you. <laughs> All right, this time we're not going to get our asses kicked. Because I have my rainbow sword now. Nice crit. Oh, look at that damage. Alright, where's the Panacea? Let's get confused off of him. Is he so confused? I don't... Nice, that's a lot of damage. Oh, damn!
Oh, it just healed. <laughs> Dude, we just fucked him up! Wow, Chrono's like insane now. Learn Sword Stream and Lightning Rod. Okay, cool. Dude, fucking wrecked. They kicked our ass the first time. All right. Oh, more enemies. They're goofy little things behind a shield. Well, we gotta see what Lightning Rod does. Except I can't for some reason. That one just didn't take any damage. Water! Okay. Oh, he just locked my spells. Damn. Alright, that should kill it. Yeah. Dude, Chrono does so much damage now with Frenzy. Holy crap. Okay, so there's stuff that way, and there's nothing up there. Okay. Alright, let's try Lightning Rod. Damn! That is a lot of damage. Leveling up too, which is great. Oh, more monsters. I want to see what that other one does. Sword stream. Bubble attack! Oh, that just healed him. Shit. Frog is very low. Heal up, frog. Nine damage, seriously. All right, nice. Uh-oh. Pretty good team, honestly, these three. Don't you stop on me.
There we go. That should kill him. All right. Nice. Okay. Let's go ahead and heal up. And save. Okay, we can keep going for a little bit. Alright. What am I fighting? Oh, it's those things? The panels on the walls? Okay. So even though he gets a lot of crits, Frenzy still does more damage, but it does cost magic, I guess, so... Frenzy might one-shot these things. Easy. Oh, more walls to fight. <laughs> Barely even hurting us, dude. We're are we, are we just like really over leveled? I'm fine with it, but okay, another possibly a boss, or are these just regular enemies? Oh, Omni Lock. Oh, they're just, yeah, they're just regular enemies. Wow, frog, seriously. missing. Oh, they're one of these. Damn. Come on, get them. <sighs> we missed out on all the experience. Damn. Oh, there's more. Okay, let's start with the small one. Yes, good. Nice. Come on, stop missing. Oh my god. Let's heal up. Frog leveled up. More of them, huh? Better than nothing. I wonder if we should be using a different party. Everybody's level 50 except Frog and Chrono who are a little bit higher level. I really would like to get some stuff between Magus and Chrono and Fle I, I think this is the team I want to use, honestly.
Damn, that does a lot of damage. Why is he so low? Shining Sphere. Those guys are still alive? Osmos? Rainbow is a great sword. Yeah, it's kicking ass, dude. Chrono's like unstoppable now. We've been beamed up. <laughs> it's a little Super Metroid y. It's like. How did it? That's not how it goes. <laughs> I was. I tried. Okay. What do we got here? Oh, it's an elevator, right? We've been in these before. We're gonna probably get attacked by a bunch of waves of enemies on, on our way down. Oh, he's running out of magic. Hold on. Oh, shit, that did, like, no damage. Holy crap. Wait, what happened? Oh, they're, like, killing each other. Hydraconda? Is that really what that thing's called? A Hydraconda? That's cool. And we are here. Okay. Whoa. More of these guys. Are they just trying to like level us up? Is that why they're giving us these? Should switch to a different party though because they're all higher level than these guys so let's just get these people in we'll have robo lead the, lead the way plus it seems like it's just gonna be a lot of these things A lot of damage that that turn. A chest. Mega elixir. Nice. 
We're using Boogie! called Hydrocondas. That's my favorite enemy name. Why do they kill each other? I don't understand why they do that. all of our magic. Good stuff. More of these things? Robo! Magic Crest? Ooh, that sounds cool. I'm guessing that's equipment. Five magic, five magic defense. God, preventing all status ailments is so good, though. We don't even know how to use this triple tech thing. Why don't we just give that to him? Now his magic defense is maxed. Got a golden earring. One of my favorite 70s bands. Golden earring. Dino tail.
Nice. Alright, good. Some of them leveled up. So, everybody's 51 except for Chrono, who's 52. Okay, so now we can kind of use whatever party we want. Let's leave Chrono out just because he, he doesn't really need the experience. Um, maybe try, like, this group. Eh, let's, let's keep Robo. Just because I like him. I'm just trying to mix up the party so we can unlock stuff. I feel like there's a lot of stuff we didn't unlock. I mean... Maybe this Black Omen's longer than I thought. I am going to have to end stream somewhat soon, though, because I do have work tomorrow, unfortunately. So we'll just... Maybe... Let's just wait till we get to, like, another big boss or something. I'm, I'm sure there's going to be another big fight in this place. Bam. Elixir and a vigilance hat. Huh. Okay, what does the vigilant hat do? Prevents all status ailments. That might be useful. So she already has that, so she doesn't need it. Frog, maybe. So it would lower his attack a little bit. Oh, it might be really good on Chrono, honestly. Greatly boosts damage. Well, he already has that, though, that, produces, that prevents status ailments. And she, she does, too. She has it. Oh, my gosh. So maybe him? All right, there we go. Wow, none of them can, like, get any kind of status ailment except for her. And even she can't get locked. Wow. But everybody else is immune. Well, and him. Okay, so Frog and Marl are the only ones that can actually be affected by status elements. Wow, that's pretty cool. This feels very like, uh, let's give you some stuff right before a, an ominous hallway. I have a feeling there's going to be a boss. Oh, yeah, definitely. And now there's a save for it. Yeah. No, okay, Nova Armor. Okay, prevents all status ailments. Wow. Okay, so give that to... Who was it? Mar well, Marl can't wear it, so maybe Frog? He does lose that huge fire reduction, but that's only really helpful if we're fighting something that does fire. We don't know if we... So maybe we'll switch it if we need to, but now he has... A little bit more defense and prevents all status ailments. So the only one who can even get status is Marl. Wow. Crazy. A Mega Elixir. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and pop a uh, shelter. And then I might change up the party. I think we want Chrono, because there's probably going to be a boss. We probably want Chrono. We probably want Mages. I think, I'm thinking bring her. I mean, we got Thunder Tr Chomp and Falcon Strike. And she does a lot of damage, although Frog's really good, too. And he has heals. We probably want somebody who can heal. Okay, let's go with that team. The boys. Let's go, boys. Um... What will you do? Oh, there's a store? Oh man, this is gonna be a big fight, isn't it? They're giving me a fucking store right before. High ether, we should probably get some of those. Oh, three of you, and in a place like this, you have a long journey ahead of you yet, so please rest here a while. Of course, if you wish to escape from the omen, I'll see what I can do. Oh, we can leave. Okay, well, I don't really think we need to leave. I mean... 
haste home. So it's, it's the same amount of defense as the Dark Helm, but it halves time between turns. That seems really good. Yeah, let's give it to Chrono, because he's going to be our main damage dealer, so nice. I should probably save again, just so I don't have to grab that every time. Because we know this boss is probably going to kill me a couple times. <laughs> Or it could just be that that's like a checkpoint and it's not actually a boss yet. What is that? Ah. It's a, it's a, it's a, oh, it's a dinosaur. That's not a dinosaur, that's just a straight up monster. Easy. Frog learned frog squash. <laughs> we gotta see what frog squash does. Uh, oh. Hey, it's those singing robots from the beginning of the game. Are these ones mean? Yes, they are. Luminaire! Instant kill. Um, should we switch out frog? I mean, yeah, I guess since there's not a, I thought there was going to be a boss, but I guess there's not. So let's just go with this group. Get them a chance to level up. We'll let Islet lead the way. Ow. I have a feeling these aren't gonna do anything. Miss. Yeah, that's right, you can't give me any status elements. Napalm! How do I kill this thing? There we go. That's a lot of enemies.
Zodiac cape. Okay, I don't, I don't know if we need that. Alright, more of these things, I guess. I like when she misses, like, it literally shows her, like, completely shooting the wrong direction. Oh, boy. I'm kind of tired. We gotta get to a boss fight. figure out the logistics of that dinosaur move like everything else can be attributed to like magic or technology but like how does she attack all the enemies on screen with a dinosaur tail like what She's out of magic. Luckily, I have tons of uh, ethers now. Actually, I don't have that many. Okay, um, who leveled up Magus? Okay, let's swap Magus out for Marl. We haven't used her in a while. Let's go with all the girls. Girl squad. Mega Elixir. Wow, that's a lot of those. Um, Let me take my action. Let me take my action. <laughs> and then she attacks that one, of course. Oh, well. I got an Antipity Bomb 3. Um, Power Crest? Ooh, that sounds good. Strength and stamina plus 10. Ooh. Or am I better off just using the oh, boost max HP? But we don't need that. Everybody's HP is already almost maxed. Um, which one's better, though? The prisms? Because it doesn't say how much this actually boosts their damage. I would assume it's pretty good, though. So is he better off with extra da damage and stamina, or is he better off with crit rate? I 
I'm just gonna stick with what I got. Okay. Well, or I give it to Robot. Because right now he has that counterattack, but I wonder if just making him stronger in general would be better. Maybe the counterattack isn't that big of a deal. We'll try it. What is that thing? Oh, it's one of those. These guys think they're so cool coming in with that, like, yellow triangle. Wait, what is that thing called? An Elder Hulk? Damn, she took a lot of damage. Uh, Blubber Hulk. Ice powers, go! Damn, she did a lot of damage. Mara leveled up, that was quick. So now she's 52, so let's get Robo back in. Just keep him even in level, I guess, you know? Capsule. I will use that on somebody. Um, okay, but now what? Oh, in there. Okay. Another speed capsule. Being beamed up. Oh, that's a lot of monsters. Okay, those alien looking things are very earthbound y. Kick, nice. And then they learned Blaze Kick, Dual Tech, nice. Good, we're unlocking stuff. So, everybody's level 52 except for Robo, so we'll let Robo catch up. Come 
on. Ah, stop missing. No, they're escaping. Robo! Dang, another speed capsule, nice. They're giving us a lot of stuff in this dungeon. Holy crap. Let's get Luca up a little more. Okay. Um, I may need to stop here. I'm actually legitimately like going to fall asleep. So um, we'll save here two times. And we'll finish Black Omen next week. Good stuff. Um, yeah, so kind of a chill stream, um, but it was a lot of fun. Let me just turn that off. And uh, we will find us somebody to raid with who we have here. Um, how about this? Frog Raid. Since Frog is a member of our party. Okay. Um. Thanks for hanging out, you guys. I'm going to take my spiky hair off. Uh, let's go say hi to Say No More, Frog Raid. Um... And um, I'll definitely be back on Thursday, maybe sooner, but definitely Thursday for Zelda. So um, have a good rest of your night, and I will see you when I see you. That's not the right button that I just pushed. <laughs> see you when I see you. There we go.